right, our day has started. We already have another change of plans. <laughs> I was super tired this morning, so is Jason. Um, had a hard time, well, we didn't get out of bed to get actually ready for school. We have great kids, and she got herself ready for school. Luckily, um, Kaylee's home in the mornings now. She doesn't have first period. And so they kind of just worked their way together and got ready. Um, and Ashley went out with her friends from the bus stop. So we just kind of both have taken a lazy morning. Um, I've showered, gotten ready. I was going to work out. But Jason's going to go um, skiing later this afternoon. So I was like, well, I don't want to sit here and work out for two hours while he's home. So I was going to spend time with him. And then Chelsea started texting us and saying that her knee really hurts her. and She can't walk on it. And there's no way she could go to PE, so she went to the nurse's office, and it's swollen, and they've had her put ice on it, and for whatever reason, they didn't want her sitting in the nurse's room, I don't know, I guess she can stay for the rest of the classes, and she just didn't want to go to PE because it hurt, so they're having her sit in the library for whatever reason, and so I'm going to go get her, and we're going to take her to urgent care. Luckily, uh, we tried to like make an appointment online and they're not doing appointments online because it's only a 15, 20 minute wait, which is a great thing. So we are just scrambling. I'm just trying to get water. I'm trying to just pound down a breakfast drink really quick. It's not my normal um, thing to eat, too much sugars, but I'm kind of in a hurry this morning. So we're gonna go. That's what we're doing. <laughs> All right, we just got Chelsea Lou. Um, we're gonna go figure out what's wrong with her knee. We're just gonna drop box off. I don't know if they let us both in. I don't know if we'll both go in. Either way, I want to be around to help her out. So okay, I'll just uh, go in and find uh, that time frame, yeah. and then go from there. Sure. Did you bring? Oh, you went and mailed packages the other. Okay. All right. Where all right. We're gonna be. We got her all checked in, um, and now it's an hour wait. <laughs> the person ahead of me, they had a half hour wait. And now, and then I, I mean, literally like two seconds later, they're like, oh yeah, your wait is an hour. And I was like, whatever. So we're just gonna, we know we can't go very far. We're just gonna go get her a smoothie um, and then come right back and we'll just sit in the parking lot and uh, probably go inside in like 40 minutes or so and uh, wait inside there. All right, well, that was two hours of our time. Well, actually an hour in there, maybe. Yeah, it was technically still two hours. Yeah. Away. But what's the verdict? Uh, <laughs> Do you know what's wrong with you? No. Maybe that's what's wrong with you. <laughs> yeah. We have a sprained knee. Yeah. Everything is, all the ligaments are in good place. And, uh, yeah, it's just this. Okay. What are you listening to? to? We gotta go to Target. Yeah, so we're gonna go get a, I don't know what she called it. Knee brace? Yeah, it's like, like a, a neopre neoprene knee oh. one where it has like a hole in the middle. Yeah. Um, and like then Kaylee's really good more fabric. -y. It's more of a fabric yeah. one. It, yeah. Uh, I so wore we'll go get that. Similar play basketball and basketball. then by the time we do that, she'll only have an hour left in school. Hour, hour and a half. We'll, we'll just be, just go home. Close to Marshalls from here. You want to go to Marshalls? Why do you want to go to Marshalls? You're just getting a free day. You want a notebook? See, I'm like... <laughs> well, are you going skiing or not? If he's going to go, then I'll go, yeah. Oh, okay. Maybe me and Chelsea will grab the other car. Go back out. Um, so we'll go get that from Target really quick and then drop him off at home. And... Well, I'll drop you guys off and you grab the other car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. But I'm glad it's not, I guess, something else. So. Yeah, I'm glad it's nothing worse. I just also knew that even if I could have gotten her a wrap and ibuprofen, the doctor's note for her PE, they just make them run every single day. So and stupid. Well, because they say since we have a smaller track, we have to run more. Yeah. Well, like, which, cause you by a little bit, and then they're like, You're yeah, running the same distance, you just have to yeah. do more laps to get it. Yeah. It's just, I don't know who's so fixated on running yeah. around here. I know. It's like, it's cold. I'm it's not the only source of e like exercise no. kids can get. Anyway, it's a source of play contention with middle school and high school PE. They just need to like not require. Anyway, we're gonna head home and continue our day. We have to do so much. Okay, we're just trying this on. 
They said that what one with the middle hole cut out is that? Well, this is the only knee brace they had over there. Uh, then I might have to take her. Uh, probably to Dick's. Or Walgreens or something. Yeah. Okay, we came to the actual like first aid section. Jason went to the sports section, so now we found one that's more fitting. I think. I think that's good, Chels. Yeah. It's like a little. Okay, why don't you hop, get up and walk with it? Support from it. Yeah. Okay. I just like it's hard to bend it. Yeah, but that's the whole point. It's giving you support. Walk all the way down. This is like when you try on shoes. Okay. Have fun skiing. Yes, yes. Yes, just a short little afternoon. A couple hours. See if you can get some videos. Nate can get you skiing or something. Yeah. I have to wait for him to move his car so that we can go. Chelsea is in the car here. We're going to go to Marshall's and... Hobby Lobby? Yeah. She's kind of ditching school today. Oh, look at that good car storage in that Tesla there. <laughs> it just like goes right through there. It's quite handy. And some boots. Okay, now he, at Target, he said he did not need to get a snack. But what do you want to bet he stops and gets some M&Ms? <laughs> I guarantee you. I guarantee he probably will. Okay. All right. Hobby Lobby is first up. We're getting art books, right? Notebooks to color and draw in, right? Okay, here we found this one. We like spiral, because then you can turn it and like the art doesn't get onto the next page. But then this one here, you want to show them what this one does? I'm buying one and she's buying one, because I will always support art. All right, so this one she wants to do so she has a full spread so that but these ones are built to lay flat yeah. and be able to draw on them versus some of these ones like they're not they have more of like a bend at the what do you call it at the spine day of skiing lots of powder for Washington it was pretty awesome actually um, now it's dumping like crazy so I'm getting on the highway headed back and we will see how it goes um, so let's take it slow and steady but it was some awesome skiing it's good stuff We've got some snowy conditions up here. It is dumping. We had a great day of skiing, but now I gotta make it home. Let's see how this goes. All right, so much of my day is spent at this desk. If ever, anyone ever wonders why I make it look so nice and organized, it's because I spend so much time here. I spent all afternoon. I'm currently deciding to order pizza. Jason is on his way home from skiing. I doubt he got any footage, but you'll have seen it already, and I will be put in my place if he has. Um, I'm adding things to my list. 
Um, and I'm taking things off. I'm also doing a lot of stuff for our Hawaii trip, um, budget wise, um, that kind of stuff. Um, I did um, try to book our photographer. We are paying a photographer this time. I've just learned in the past it hasn't worked. And I haven't heard back from my cousin with a referral from Maui. Her husband grew up in Maui, um, but she hasn't been able to find a referral. So I just found one, Pine and Palm Photography. They just had a cool story. Someone, I think one of you recommended it and have used them before and you're going to use them again April or May, I think, if I remember correctly. And um, I just love it because one of them grew up in Hawaii and the other one grew up in Oregon. And now they live there and have this photography business. And I, that's like totally us, like Northwest meets Hawaii. Um, and it's a couple that does it. So I just was like, you know what, let's just support local. And it was a decent price for an hour session. And um, anyway, so I'm just waiting to hear back from them if our dates are available. I know this. <laughs> if our dates are available for them to do. Um, and then we will officially book it. Um, what else have I been doing? You, what are you doing? Valentine's. And you kind of got done a dirty, didn't you? Yeah. Valentine's have gotten so expensive and so cheapskate, you guys. Since when do you have to cut out your own Valentine's? These should be pop out. These should be little cards already like pre-made. No, she's having to cut every single one of these stupid things out. And then shove the little stick into the hole. I Luckily the hole works. Your friends are calling you. Um, super annoying. You can hear it. This is what... <laughs> Her device is still connected to mine so that I can monitor because she's so young. But just so you can get a reference. Her friends are trying to FaceTime you. Is that correct? So I hear it in my earbuds. Stops my show that I'm currently watching. It rings on her iPad, which is right here. It rings on my phone, rings on my computer, like I said, and it also rings on my laptop. It's every call, every FaceTime, every text message, but it's out of safety, it's out of you know precaution to monitor, and hey, maybe we aren't being so nice. <laughs> Certain friends are a little bit more dramatic than others. Um, but anyway, I'm just sitting here working. I can't really work on my computer and edit today's video because I'm trying to do software updates. Um, but it's a good day to do it because I can edit tomorrow and whatnot. But, um, but anyway, so yes, Ashley is kind of going through and um, working on her Valentine's. And then she has her Valentine's that she got her friends that she will give them tomorrow. Um, I told her if she didn't want to cut these out, she I'm could make... make I, <laughs> I was like, well, you... Oh, she could make 25 or 24 little, uh, what do you call them, perler bead hearts. And we could stick the little sucker down into one of the perler beads and tie it on. She's like, nope, not doing that. <laughs> but, if it but anyway, I'm going to, yeah, let me decide on whether I'm going to get carry out pizza or wait, and for, wait for Jason to pick it up. It is snowing where he is at and has been snowing. It was hailing on you. Should we go out and see if it's still out there? And it is supposed to snow at eight o'clock, which is in three hours. We shall see if it actually snows for us. But you know, we actually haven't gotten snow in February before. So we'll see. Oh, holy cow, it's still hailing. Um, well, look at that. The hail did stick. It's still on Kaylee's car up there. You can see that on the truck bed over there so maybe it will stick tonight and it's supposed to snow for a couple hours but it's so wet like it has been so like warm if you want to say warm is 50 40 50 degrees during the day but then when it rains I mean we're just a soggy wet mess it just doesn't stick so unless this hail kind of sticks out here and stays kind of frozen on the ground like that snow's not gonna stick but I told Jason I was like it's gonna snow here soon which means you're gonna have a snowy pass if it's already snowing up by you why don't you come on home how you doing gimpy yeah well we should probably get some ibuprofen back in yeah yep but it feels better to have that on doesn't it yeah yeah all right um 
Ashley, we need to clean up. <laughs> Looks like Ashley has taken residence into this corner of the couch. She has slept here the past three nights, I think. I'm not sure why someone's calling me or it's her friends. It's Jason. Hang on. Standing underneath the lights Look into each other's eyes Tired snowflakes are coming down Collapse into water when they hit the ground All right, Jason's here with pizza, but I just wanted to show you the newest addition from Jacob. It is um, another reflector from the road. And it came with bolts and a washer. So that was super fun. And our pizza is here. Ooh, it's hail. Can you guys see that on his car? That is hail. Help. What the hail? <laughs> yeah, no, it's coming down. It's sticking up just a little bit up the way. Oh, yeah? So are you guys going to help or are you just going to yeah, stand there? I'm, I'm just going to stand here. Grumpy. I'm not grumpy. I yeah, you are. Be I nice. I'm standing in the rain to unload all this. Oh. You just skied in the snow all day. Don't complain. Yeah, but I don't get wet. Oh. I drop on. <laughs> oh. Hey, Ashley, did I do good? No. Yeah. She wanted dom uh, Domino's, yes? No. You can't have the cinnamon sticks until you have pizza. Do you understand me? Take those. I got pan pizzas this time. Nice. Pan pizza. Good job, love. Pan yes. Pizza. So it turns out the order is wrong. We only ended up getting one pepperoni pizza and not two. And this is um, Canadian bacon and pineapple. It would have worked because I could just take the pineapple and Canadian bacon off and Ashley would have loved having cheese pizza. But it's not even fully cooked. It's like doughy. And so, but it's not a surprise. Once we were over at our friend's house and they got pepper. They got the order all they messed up. They got it mixed up five times. So yeah. Just like so I called one we're gonna try and cook this pizza we're just gonna we got the oven preheated try and get that one cooked so we can like utilize it and I called and I told them you know mess up the order is there any way for you guys to deliver one I know it was carry out but like you guys made the mistake and she's like oh I'm a I'm down a driver and I'm an hour out from being able to deliver anything she's like I I, I will replace the pizza obviously like we made messed up I need to get you a pizza and I was like so what is the wait time if I were to just come pick it up and she's like 15 minutes <laughs> I was like, then I'll save you the hassle and I'll come get it from you because we literally don't have pizza for Kaylee and Jacob to eat when they wake up and you're still hungry right mm -hmm. okay go get another piece because we'll have another one in a half hour it takes me 15 20 minutes to get down there and then come all the way back down and or back home and it you said it's it's well you saw it's hailing and I need to get home it's before eight there, yeah. um before it actually starts to snow and snow create a problem start, start snowing away mm -hmm. but they didn't get the parmesan sticks wrong and she said for the inconvenience she said would you like any brownie bites or or something as an inconvenience bonus and I was like Oh, we could use some cinnamon sticks because that was Ashley's request. So, yeah, because everyone ate them before I even got to. We ended up with a better deal, but we're kind of hungry now. So, it feels, it's an inconvenience, but. It's Canadian pineapple, is okay. It's okay if it, if it was fully cooked, but it's like completely doughy. It's okay. It's, I don't know. It's not my favorite. It's not my favorite. Sorry, pizza. Canadians. <laughs> I don't think they're going to be offended. It's not really Canadian, made, no. apparently. Mm -mm. We just like to put other, like, French fries. Oh my goodness. I don't think they're French. You're being annoying. Mm. Uh, that's really sticking. Wow. Um, luckily I know this car does well. All right, so I have my sister on the phone with me. She was, I was chatting with her while I drove down here. Like, complete snowstorm, um, hail. And then I got down here and I couldn't figure out why I couldn't see with my headlights. They're completely covered over with snow. 
in just the amount of time it took from Jason being inside the house, dropping off the pizza, eating a piece, getting in the car and coming down here, they were completely covered. Then I get out of the car here at Domino's, I'm right here, and all of a sudden we see a flash in the sky. And we don't get thunder and lightning here, you have to understand. Flash in the sky and within two seconds it was full thunder for like, no joke, like 10 seconds. And I was like, um, that's a massive storm right over the top of us. And then as I, as I came out of Domino's after getting the pizza, it was like doing it again, just full on rumbles. So anyway, I'm gonna put the camera down while I drive home, say goodbye to my sister and just yeah, drive, right? here. <laughs> she's like, maybe you should get off the phone. And, but anyway. It's all good. I was looking to see if it's snowing. It says it's snowing right now, but we're right on this line of whether it was going to snow on us or not. And I think they're just off by a little bit. <laughs> it's not snowing out there. Um, but that weather was really crazy. Uh, thunder, lightning, snow, hail, like crazy. Um, and now, ironically, we have too much pizza because Jacob had to go home so that he could make it up his hill when we thought it was gonna keep on snowing. So he didn't end up eating and then Kaylee didn't end up eating because she didn't feel good at the moment. And still doesn't feel like having pizza, so now we have too much. <laughs> we have a ton of these little, uh, what do you call these, Parmesan bites. So we're gonna box that up. Um, but I'm gonna finish watching Bachelor and I'm gonna go to bed. Um, I have a long day today. I have a long day tomorrow. Um, so I'm gonna go and get rested up. Uh, Take care. See you guys next time. Easy, easy on our tiptoe.